my mind is completely absorbed in Sri Radha. Yeah, that's the point. Yeah. If not absorbed, useless. It's better to do business. Honestly, it's Sanchari Who is the essence of elegance? The essence of rasa. Elegance, how much you want to be rich? She is the most richest. Elegant. Full. Elegant means? Beautiful and charming in her. That, that is the charm of her, not bodily charm. That is very light. Beauty and charm is this that the Creator attracts. Who creates the Maya Shakti, he forgets his Maya Shakti and he become running to her. Sure. You can imagine this, elegant of her. We run for the Maya Shakti and the Creator Maya Shakti make it and the he start running for Yoga Maya Shakti, Ma, Bhava Shakti. He forget that he creates different, different parts. He forget his identification. He lose in the love. He said to the Vedas and Purana to preach this whole Dharma, Artha, Kama, Mokta, and he forget that. <laughs> huh? He break, start breaking rule himself by elegant of Radhika, make him crazy. Jai <laughs> And she is the essence of rasa. Because Krishna, is rasa is Krishna. She is the... The heart of his heart. Yes. There is nothing for her. That is the key devotion. Krishna don't know to teach devotion how he will teach you. He is enjoy, enjoy not not devotion. Now he has to take her love and her golden effulgence to learn how to feel her devotion. And she is the only essence of bliss. And the essence of compassion. She is the essence of all sweet, effulgent, and beautiful forms. And the essence of cleverness. And the essence of amorous playfulness. Yes, in this text it's called Akila Sara Sare. She is the complete essence of the essence.
the word Sara means the most enjoyable part of a substance. That is Sara. That is the lion. Lake. The wire of the love. And Sri Radha is the essential part of God's Svaru Shakti. So Svaru Shakti coming to the Jiva from her. She, she can give the sarup. That is coming from sarup shakti. He give her shakti in our sarup to relate with. How you can explain after five nine days? Every word has to explain to understand yourself. We don't become so intelligent and one point in us. No, first of all, we are not so intelligent, and second of all, it is unlimited. So every word has to understand. Mm. If you want to go deep in sara, mm. if you want to be in sarup sakti, we have to be dasi, not a guide guru. Mm. Yes, to revive our Dasi bath and to live in it, that is the highest what we can achieve. And then we are not the teacher, but we are the eternal student. Yeah. That is what is our... Anything is happening. Because of Guru Kripa yes. and Hari Kripa, mm. yes. they have to worship, mm. not this plastic body. Mm. This plastic big body become useful by her grace. Mm? By her grace. Her grace mm. and her dashi grace. Mm. Yes, this is our constant meditation. Everything that is good in this human existence in my life comes by the grace of Guru and Radha. Dasi. Dasi is grace, because my Guru is her Dasi. Yeah. So that is the grace. Dasi come after, Guru come first. Yes. Mm. Guru Dasi not come first. Then up, money up a man. You not respect right. Mm. You disrespect her. Mm. Boss is always boss. In everything that happens, in all the persons I meet, and especially in my spiritual guides, I see her mercy coming through. Any, t any time we get the late in our spiritual progress because of misunderstanding. There is nothing, is a key, open key. This is the key to open. There is nothing to study. Nitya Siddha Krishna Prem. Krishna Prem is Nitya Siddha. But you find the book, in the book, in the person, 
who is he himself become guru. And I open the key from Radhika to Krishna is open. <coughs> See from the eyes of Radhika to Krishna is not a big job. He sees your somni. You can see from the eyes of your boss to anyone. That is the key. The yes. key is to see everything through the eyes of my, our Swami. Yeah. Through her love. That through her point. feelings. Why you want to see from her? It's not son. external that we have to learn from books. Yeah. So simple and so easy. Why you make cool? <laughs> yes. So Sri Radha is the essential part of God's Varup Shakti. It's innate energy. It's better energy. to keep your things in your cup, in, a, in, in, in the glass and everything there. This is your, no, keep there. Keep oh, 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 oh. Okay. Not here, uh -huh. that is problem. And that Svarup Shakti is called Ladi. Uh -huh. That Sarup Shakti is Allah. Who living in the Allah, madness of you. And this Allah comes down to all of her dasis. And Lavanya Sara means the quintessence of effulgence or luster. The Bhagavatam. Sara again, Prema, Prema Sara. Mm. The the found the 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 place of the where the love is coming out. The fountain of love. Fountain. And the creator has to take twenty four seven from this fountain. Yes. He this is. this is Sara. His source of love and Ananda. That is the Lavanya Sara. This is Sara of Radhakrishna. Who not understand after going, the love fountain is coming from this place. Then what we go there? And this Krishna Sham. Or twenty four seven is drinking this twenty four seven. She is the Sana and he is the Rapa. Because of this found flowing, he becomes with full of her. Which is the beauty of it. Mm. So he becomes supreme. Mm. So much. He is living from her love. Yeah. And she's living in his love. Rasik <laughs> And she, Sara want to make her Rasik Sekha. Because the highest, because she loves. Our lover cannot be a lowest person because he received the love. The, even the devotee who received the love of Radhika, they become high. <coughs> because of her. Her um, love is a powerful energy. The most powerful. More unconditional. He is never found in the any verse, in the inverse, any place.
unconditional love, everybody is seen and tired of it. Yes, very tired. So, when, yes? You have to pay back. That is my treasure of mine. You have to pay for it. that receiving that. And good money, good payment. Good payment. Good payment. So the business in this material world is you beat me, I scratch you. That's what Shri Mataji said. You have to give yourself. I love you because you have to give all your body and senses and everything to me. Yes. Mm. Because you, I want to enjoy. Huh. I want everything. And, and Sri Radhika said, you take everything what you like. But I don't want anything. So. Hmm. She teaches. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. I will give you. I have nothing, but I can give you everything. <laughs> wow. I have no education, no qualification, no wealth, nothing. I am not very rich. Born the one small king, but what I have nowhere you can find it. <laughs> That is my song. She gives everything. She is the source of this all ananda and bliss and love and unconditional love. Everyone who receives this and is in contact with that will also take on her qualities and will be protected through everything. Because as you said yesterday, Krishna himself will protect the dogs and cats of Swamini. Protected, you see, here also, Baba. Protection, what do you bother for? <laughs> All his creator, Devi Devta, will protect you. Yeah. Automatic when we are Dasis, we all. In He will world. protect, his all creation will protect. All things come favorable. This is a nice point. All things become favorable. Every aspect, all what I watch, wow. all what I feel, yeah. all what I smell, what I eat, all yeah. the connection yeah. becomes favorable. Right. See? Yeah. And then there is an exchange because That no, when, 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 because it is love. When, 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 can you do the when? It's a dance <laughs> of love. Yes. No, oh, it will do the when. It's here. Wow. It is close to bone. This is the knee from knee come. Knee, 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 knee. From the knuckle, do oh. it. Mm -hmm. It's, mm -hmm. it's yeah. like a massage from here, especially if it's here on, on point. Like it's a massage. Okay. I'm doing. Yeah. Here, and nervous yatigo. Okay. Yeah. Nervous yatigo, very dense. What is the sciatica? Sciatica, se llama. Bhagavatam describes Krishna as Lavanya, Saram. And when one asks, is this luster or effulgent not present in other gods or form of gods also? Then the Bhagavatam answers, Asamortvam. No luster is equal as some or higher, Urdvam. 
Then Krishna. Mm. And when one asks, where has Krishna's luster come from then? Mm. Then the answer is Ananya Siddham. There is no other source than Krishna himself. It is self perfect. But Shridhaga is the essence of Lavanya even in Krishna's eyes. Sri Radha is the empress of Lavanya. How much knowledge from her? Anandar Baba is all quotation. We find, we cannot find. Sri Radha. Yes, and then from the Krishna come. Krishna. And where is the Radha living? Allah the nature. He then on the revised world will Shri Krishna says in Ujvala Ninam, O oh Radhe, the Creator has collected the essence of all spotlessly beautiful things of the world to make your body. Oh, do I beauty, the rays that emanate from your lips defeat even the splendor of mirrors made of jewels. Shrimati is also Rasa Sara Sukhaika Sara. The most delicious happiness for the essence of Rasa. Who is the essence of Rasa? It's Sri Krishna. The Upanishads say of God, Rasa Vai Saha. He is Rasa. But Sri Krishna is Akila Rasamrita Murti, the very form of all nectarian transcendental flavors. And he contains unlimited sweetness. Indeed, he is sweetness personified. His sweetness steals the hearts of all moving and non-moving living beings. <coughs> and he even enchants himself with it. <coughs> So Krishna himself is enchanted by his sweetness. But Radhika can enchant him. So Gurudev, this is like an ongoing increasing of ecstasy and love between both of them. It's a never ending fountain of this not ending. When they come to reach the the line actually. Yes. His sweetness personified. His sweetness steals the hearts of all moving and non-moving living beings. So they go to the Krishna, moving and non-moving. And he even enchants himself with his sweetness with it. Govinda is the quint essence of Rasa. 
and Sri Radha is the quintessence of his happiness. Sri Radhika can only be compared to herself. And there is no one else like her. For with her attributes, she gives joy to all of Krishna's senses. To know Krishna is a girl, to enjoy the all senses and satisfy Krishna's senses, what a problem. Mm -hmm. Only to knowing is so much time taking, but not career. <laughs> Go on. Never clear, mm -hmm. uh -huh. but Sri Radhika makes everything very clear. Or Sri Radha is the only essence of bliss and rasa in general. Shripad Kavikarnapur says, Rase Saras Chamakkaro. The essence of Rasa is astonishment. Who is astonished to Krishna? Hmm. Okay. Also, this is the last word. He astonished means there is nothing. Surprise. Where you will find this word in your words? So deep meaning. And it is also, um, I, I should be open to be astonished. If I'm fixed and I know what everything is going on, I'm not an astonished because it's usual. But, it is, but my, if my heart is open, I can receive. Wow. I can be astonished. Yeah. And when I'm astonished, I'm grateful because it is amazing that what, what there is now in this. And I'm just at the point my consciousness is not deviated because I'm astonished. There's something that good. There was there was before. So it it takes me at all. Completely. Yeah. So that is means so that it is not covered. Pure. Pure. Yes. Astonishing. He in a stage of astonishing surprise. And what the Shastra do, they cover so much in the lines and the words that you are not astonished. You read and read and read and bore and, and no understanding. And for why you are reading? For Krishna, you don't know. Still you are not astonished by that. And she is astonished to Krishna. Imagine, hmm. and I don't want to guide her feet. We guide the feet of the Father. That's only old habits. 
this is the mercy of Narayan Bhagavan. <coughs> Only when he gives the word, we are not searching that meaning of that, because never practice for that. He was practiced, he want to make sure. Wow. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> he is preparing to know about Radhika, to be a come in your sarupali. He is want to do that, but <laughs> we are running with Krishna and philosophy. <laughs> he said that I come to say you that Krishna is not a supreme God. Why he said this? To bring me in the Braja mood. And the Braja mood is always full of astonishment. The Braja mood. So he want to bring for that. Preparing this is the hidden path of devotion is a preparation that he cannot explain that. So he gives the words, you will read, but the, we are in the words only. We never realize it. We not understand it is not a philosophy. Only one time reading the words. You have to practice. The more astonishing, the more our heart gets pure, and the more astonishing the world. That's the point. Without purity, astonishment will not come. Suddha Chitra, Savanadi, Karai Udara. What we don't know, it will appear. What Krishna don't know about love, it appears. Then he becomes Raso Vaisha, Rasa Sekhar. So he is a supreme God. When I was just listening about astonishment, I just felt like if we feel like small and young and like somehow like children, pure, innocent, and then we can be astonished because everything else is bigger. Jai Ho! Jai Ho! Jai Ho! Jai Ho! This is my daily power. Our high power. <laughs> Once you were chastising me, Lord, and your words were so simple, but I understand. Lord said to me, You have become so big. <laughs> you have become so grown up. <laughs> You can see many grown up people. Yes. It's hard to find the children. <laughs> yes, true. <laughs> it, it will become so hard. Why, 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 why? We can see because we are astonished by the grace of Radhika when we see the bigger person. What happened to them? <laughs> So 
So, Sri Radha is the only essence of bliss and rasa. The essence of rasa is astonishment, says Shripad Kavikanapur. And the Madana Mahabhav of Sri Radhika is the most <coughs> astonishing and the most relishable rasa. Therefore, she is the quintessence of rasa and bliss. She even astonishes Govinda. <coughs> Govinda is bliss personified, but she makes even him, as well as all the devotees, happy. Sukha Nakaza nice quote of Chaitanya Chaitamrita about this happiness that she gives to all. Sukha Rupa Krishna Kaure Sukha Ashwadam Bhaktagana Sukha Dite Ladini Kara Thus, Sri Radha is the only essence of bliss. So this Ma Madana Bhav, Madana Mahabhav Gurudev, that is said here, Baba says that Madana Bhav, Mahabhav of Sri Radhika is the most astonishing and the most relishable rasa for Krishna. So that is when she, in her love, takes on all these different astonishing feelings that she forgets that she is together with him. This... Uh, yeah, come to end the uh, light. Yes? Yeah, this paragraph. Finished, yeah. Yeah. It was the whole paragraph about her Rasa Sahara and now this is the, the highlight or the end of this paragraph about her Madana Mahabhav. What I just feel is when everything is astonishing, you have not to be born again. You just go in your swerve and that's it. After this body is not anymore working and doing what it should do, you go in your swaru, and then it goes on with the astonishment. When you learn what is astonishment, and anurag means that always new, every time everything is new, and when that is going on in your meditation, you just go. You leave the body like a like a coat. That's it. But is isn't the body? But isn't the body also so astonishing so that um, perhaps when I see that all the structures are servants to me, my muscles, they are waiting for an order and they are working and then blood is flowing and then breathing is going on and it is so subtle, organized, so really well performed. It is every joint is a single game. It is really special and it has it, it has forms there, there are no edges in the body. Each form is a bit concave or convex 
and they are fitting perfectly together, individually. Yeah. And the body is serving the soul, and like a mountain, perhaps. Yes. Selfless. Yeah. <laughs> so good, if you would choose your muscles, they, they want to serve you, they are dying. Because they get no order. Yes, depends always on the perspective. We can see the one everywhere. Yes, yes, Ramon. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Gurudev, I just have one more question about this Madana Mahabal. Can, is it right to say that this is the essence of this astonishing and most relishable rasa? Because this is when they exchange the personalities and everything happens that is unexpected in the Leela and that is for Krishna so relishable that her love makes him forget himself and also herself. Is this a general? That is the thing that is all divine. Yes. And this divine body took Narva the Leela yes. for our understanding because we are coming from this material identification. Yes. How to understand easily the divine couple is this is up to divin divinity and they took the form yes. to understand Narvata Lila like a human they behave. That human can understand, animal will not understand. <coughs> If they are animals, they will, they will, Krishna will bring for the cow feeding. Yes. They can do only, he can have to feed the food and they will do the eating and sleeping and sex. Who, who want to be realize this divine thing, they will astonish. So human like pastime is to understand this reality of that. This is the Narvatali. It's spiritual thing. We see pastime first. Then we start looking from my body. Not this divinity we see that. This divinity not understanding is not clear. We only see in my bodily consciousness. We don't need sarup and sarup siddhi. No need. Why do I need? It's two problem. And who do this practice? in his sadhak deha, for them it is very difficult to go in Siddha there. They block and they have to clean that. Yeah. 
And when it's not clean, it will take every time to clean it. So we block myself by reading the pastime and uh, uh, go with the Lila Mitha and this book of Ra, uh, Gajadhar Pran and block ourselves. And ninety percent people they read Govinda Mitha. And they block, I see that. Yeah, the tendency is there to see it from material side. Because we don't know because anything Because they only pass time to talk, without detail understanding. Why I recommend Vilap Kusumanjari and Radha Rasudhanidhi, this blockage can clean many times after study if this Aparadha No other way. When I will read the past time, we don't understand. Like a human, we understand. And when never read past time, till this are not to be. This is actually a very nice point what you just mentioned. Why? Because when you say human like means it looks like human but it is not human. Right? This is one point. And when you say like human, it is like I human. Don't say no 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 Maran Maharaj is No no I, I I'm saying in English when you say like human means you imitate. You want to imitate, but when you say human like you understand that it looks like human, but you can never, this is always divine. It looks like human, but it's always divine. But when you say like human, you say it's it's like human, like like us. And it's not, not like this. Like you. Uh, Only like that we can understand, that we can feel it. Human like, nah? human like. Human like, uh, like human, there's a difference. I don't know the so much English word. Yeah, there is a big difference. Because no, no I don't understand. My English is not very good, but Narabhata Leela I understand. Yeah, this is human like. Yeah. So my English not go because it is my foreign language. So, so Narabhata Leela, we do the human like or what you say, because human can understand, animal will not understand. Then animals goes with the cow. Krishna cares that out. But because of the animal body, they will not understand. I just I just didn't refer what you were saying. I just no, I did. my what, English I say something no, no, she and he say <coughs> I say many words like this. Don't Take my words meaning. Take the meaning of that word. None of the leader. Yeah, exactly. Like a bow. What is the translation? I cannot know. I feel the big difference between these two books and the other books is when I read other books, I look from outside and I'm like a viewer and it's. It's. I don't. I'm. I'm not in it, and I. It, it's. It has nothing to do with me. I'm just looking, and I might understand or not. But if I read these two books, it's from my original position. I look as a manjari, and I look from my point of view of service. It's not. I want to be there, and I want to be one of these two. It's from my original position, so it's completely different. Completely different vision is there. <coughs> this is, I think, very good point. <coughs> because uh, Guru Dev said, uh, Krishna is Narabhat Lila. Narabhat means someone who has human body, like. 
and uh, our misunderstanding is uh, if unless we are not uh, fix ourselves to the to the Radha Dasi, if we don't have Stai Baba, then if we lead some leader, then our tendency to move Sanchari. Or oh, 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 today I want to become mother, or oh, today I become Saka, or oh, today maybe Saki, maybe Gopi. This tendency is always there. That is more nice, more, more, more worse, worse, worse is the thing is all. Oh, they are like human, like me. And then we thinking, Radha Krishna Lila is material, that is the worst thing. So, therefore, Guru Deva is thinking, at first we fix ourselves in the Stai Baba. And go to fix it, and also fix the same Baba. For us, Manjari Baba. And then if we fix it, we can see any leader as Manjari's uh, point of view. Then we can, we can, we, we, we have no problem. But uh, we, if we don't fix it, then we have tendency to Sanchari. That is good David's warning us. <coughs> And important. Thus, Sri Radha is the only essence of bliss. She is also the essence of compassion. First, one must realize what compassion means before we can understand what the quint essence of compassion means. Sri Bhatiya uh, Ramanuja Acharya writes, compassion means that one gives up all selfishness and one cannot tolerate the suffering of others. These feelings are not possible towards that matter, only towards living beings. Although the soul is by nature transcendental, it is still under the full control of time, karma, maya, and God. God, you know, so <laughs> the soul is at the control of this. So we want to be in soul consciousness is a gopi. But after that, <laughs> in the soul form also we are in control. Gopi <laughs> Prabhupada also said last line, I say all this. Baba explain more details. So when we understand how they are using which words, we understand also some of the moods for it. Yeah. He's using the word God to make sure it is not Krishna. No Krishna. But lastly, time. What second Prabhupada quotation give? Wow. When I see the Prabhupada, okay, how he explained the Bhagavad Gita is in Siddha Sarup. Amazing, huh? huh? Amazing. To the person who layman in the preparatory class, 
the, we like what? Time, God, soul, Dharma. five types. Ah. <laughs> Second, Sarup Sarup <laughs> Siddhi, not. Mm. You start from here. There, this page I leave it like this, no understanding. We don't know relation, we never intimate with him because Guru has to be intimate. Mm. Guru is the goal. <laughs> it will, why not to escape it? No. If we don't have a. If our goal is not to Swarupa and Swarupa City, Guru Dev saying, then we have to go through this time, karma, maya, and God. So therefore, most of the Guru... Uh, soul avoid, also, soul uh, is soul. five yes. things. Uh, soul, yes, soul. So therefore, most of the Guru avoid this uh, talking about intimacy, relationship, and uh, our Swarupa and our goal. So therefore, this is the saying, uh, interesting. But Prabhupada must be used. First to do this. If you cannot do this, do this. You cannot do this, do this. You cannot do this, do this. Read again introduction. Mm. Then you will understand. He is important. We'll have Kusum Anjali after you can. How you will understand Prabhupada Master? Unfortunately, uh -huh. <laughs> unfortunately, Prabhupada followers, so-called follower like us, <laughs> we don't understand the reality. No, you are not follower of Prabhupada. You are follower of American Guru. Yeah, Sorry yeah. to say. Yeah, yeah. You are not so, follower of Prabhupada. Yeah, therefore I say so-called. Yeah. <laughs> so-called. <laughs> ah, beta. Radhe Radhe. First class, by it, Mahota, Mahota, Kahe Kata. First class, by it. Yes, 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 by it. He still likes to accept the service of his devotees, and therefore he creates the desire for devotional service in the hearts of the fortunate candidate devotees. No? He creates the desire to desire for the service. So we really feel like we want to do service. So this is also mercy. When we are inclined to do service, Mera blood pressure you upar karwao yaar. Mera blood pressure down. So we self-satisfied as the Supreme Lord, but still because he likes to accept service from his supporters, and that thus he creates the desire for service. So we see even the desire for service is coming not from us only. The, maybe say, being open for mercy <laughs> of this life, no? Also, Krishna has Icha Shakti. Icha Shakti. Krishna's one energy has Icha Shakti, kind of desire. So he can inspire us to do something. And also that's coming from Guru Dev. Guru Dev sometimes inspires to do. To, to do some seva for other people. 
Bago go so the desire comes from Krishna or God in this case, Jiva Goswami says, and in our case also from Gurudev, who creates a desire in ourselves, and then we can do devotion. This ourselves. is the point. Repeat this one. Although God is self-satisfied, he still likes to accept the service of his devotee and therefore he creates the desire for devotional service in the hearts of the fortunate candidate devotees. And he inspired us to do that good. Only rascal and foolish who say that follow me. <coughs> yeah, this he quotes Jiva Goswami. That is a quote of Jiva Goswami. Amazing. From Pretty Sandharva. You know, he gives his words. Maybe coming now. No, no, his words means quotation. Yeah, quotation. He is not his, his realization, not quotation. Who can do talk more than this? Only to repeat the words I will speak. And if you have a test, you will repeat only the words of it. To speak with the words. And not change your words. That's parampara. 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 Avita. Thus, his heart is melting with compassion. He is filled with the desire to benefit the conditioned souls. And the greatest gift is devotion and love. This is also a gift, Guru. Ah, devotion and love. God, God. <laughs> All given. <laughs> gift means given. And we cut the this. Radhe Radhe. Jai Ho Maharaj, Kaise Aapki kripa bandhi rahe, aapka prem bana rahe hamko, aapki prerna se hi hem brinda bana hai. Ah, it's a when my eyes directly saw your part, Radha Kunda, which is filled with sweet water and lotus flowers, surrounded by the sweet honeybees, then I really got the desire to taste the nectar of your service. Yes, the Radha Kunda also began this desire to taste the nectar Obviously, <laughs> अब हम लोग शरीर से तो लाचार हैं हृदय से तो रहते ही हैं हम देखते हैं अरे भैया मेरा तो 78 में ये हाल है 
आप तो भैया अपना साधक देहा तो लाचार है अपना सिद्ध देहा तो साथ दे रहा है कोई साथ देगा तो वही जाएगा अपने भैया एक बात कहना चाहते थे बबुआ को मेरा खूब ब्लेसिंग कहिए और कहिएगा कि उसने बड़ा अच्छा काम किया अपने मित्र को फोन कर दिया था आरम को मुंगेर को तो प्रशांत जी को बड़ा वेलकम किया और उसने कहा कि हम इसमें जो भी जैनविन होगा और जल्दी करवाते हैं समझ गया भैया और आप उसको कहिएगा उसको दे इसको अलग करा दे वो सरद जो है ना उसके लिए खराब हो गए हैं भैया परेशान करते हैं क्योंकि हम लोग को उसी से पैसा मिलता है और उनको दस एगर से आते हैं तो हम लोग को तंग करने के लिए ऐसा कर रहे हैं उनसे हमको अलग करा दे भैया उनका अलग भाई थे अलग हो गया अब क्या करें हम तो नहीं कर सकते ना मेरा तो बेटा है ना भैया मगर अगर वो मदद करके करवा दे उससे अलग ये सब तो अलग अलग हुआ है एग्रीमेंट हुआ है सेपरेटली और उसके बाद भी दोनों भाई का अलग करा देना बस सब दोनों का सबका एग्रीमेंट हुआ हुआ है सब बंटवारे का पेपर दिया हुआ है तो हमको बड़ा जय जय उसको जरा कहिएगा ना लीगल तो पैसा कौड़ी दे के करवा देता है इधर उधर बदमाशी कर सकता है प्लीज उसको कह के वो लेके कर देगा तो हम हम झंझट नहीं करना चाहते हैं भैया वो चाहता है कोर्ट के चरी बाप को ले जाए बेटे के लिए हम नहीं कर सकते हमको लड़ना नहीं आता है हमको हम मरने वाले हैं लड़े हम नहीं कर सकते हैं तो हमको ऐसा नहीं पोजिशन सुधार दे मेरे को बच्चे लोगों को दुखी नहीं होगा आप कहिए उसको कही कि अपना काम समझ के उसको कराना भैया हम क्या बता ऐसी हालत है कि हम उनको And also one thing came to my heart right now, and it is when you say that we speak about compassion, we speak actually about the heart. Ram, 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 दूसरा इशू लगा के लड़ेगा वो बहुत हम तो छोड़ देना चाहते हैं सब What again? Compassion, Guru. Uh, it's so nice this point of compassion. It's not only that Krishna is giving desires that we can do service, but the greatest gift comes through His pleasure potency. 
Krishna maintains the devotees with his pleasure potency and that pleasure potency is Sri Radha. Krishna is maintaining the devotees with his And his pleasure potency. You can imagine. Now Krishna has accepted. This is Radha Kund. What? This is Radha Kund. Radha Kund, yes. This darshan, you can get it in Radha Kund. Krishna maintained the devotees. They feel Laita Kund, Vishaka Kund, other Kund. And they give to others, they give to others. But this coming from Radha This is the darshan of Radha Kuru. Yeah, this is the This is the meaning of Radha yes. The source of this pleasure you can see is Radha Kuru. And this is Radha. Our Acharyas. Why the highest place? This is the point. Yes, this one verse, then Raghunath Bhaya gave me the Vilap uh, Kushmanjali verse 15. It also says that since I saw Radha the desire to engage in your service came in me. That is the proof also that. Radha who is not different from Shrimati Radhika, is giving the highest desires to become dancing in Manjari Bhav and learn this. So when we go there in this mood, then we are blessed. And that is the highest compassion that Radhika is giving to us all to develop these desires from the service as a maid And now Krishna has accepted the luster and mood of Sri Radha and has descended as Gora to bless all the conditioned souls of the age of Kali the most benevolent gift of Radha Noga Prem, which was hidden in the storehouse of Prajas Nikonjas. It was hidden, Guruji, because nobody had access to this, how to practice and how to get this right Sky bath in the mood of the Madras. And then you can only be easily fooled or derived, like means you have a misunderstanding according to bodily pla platform. Uh. Or you can only come to the conclusion that you have to be a sucky. You get stuck in this. Yeah or you get stuck in this kind of desire to be like Radha or to be like Krishna. Many possibilities that we can misunderstand the Nikunja Leelas of Jai Nature. Ho, Jai ho. Many, many. And now we are blessed this is so to get <laughs> this Now is they will get benefit. And now I understand Guru just in this moment that this treasure is so high and so rare and to share it with the souls is really also something special. No? To be able to do this service, not only to ourselves but to others, this is a great mercy. Mahaprabhu's <laughs> love and mercy is Radha's love and mercy. Now she wants to flood the world of this mercy. It's golden volcano of divine love. 
Oh yeah, there is yeah, one book I want to side. recommend. This is Golden Volcano of Divine Love. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. 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 Every time when we read this new, the fountain of love is new, created by the Lord's mercy. Always deeper, it seems. Yes. yes. So therefore, astonishing. Every astonishing. moment, everything new. Exactly. Don't miss the astonishment.